Here in Boulder, Colorado, it was a sensational home opener for the Colorado Buffaloes. There's Sefo Lufau, their four-year starter under center, back from a foot injury. He was brilliant, and the Buffaloes demolish Idaho State. They went 56-7. Greg Wolf, Eric Coleman with you, and Eric... Sefo was hot from the start. He was hot from the start. He hit his open receivers. He was making check downs. He ran the ball when the receivers weren't open. Overall, great decision making by Sefo and an overall great game. Did it with his legs as well as he runs in for the touchdown here. He can do a little bit of everything, and that's why he's such a dangerous quarterback because he also knows how to run this new up-tempo offense. Yeah, he knows how to run the offense. He can get it to the receivers. And defensively, they were all over Idaho State today uh, in the secondary. They were knocking down passes. Up front, they were getting pressure on the quarterback, and they were also stopping the run, getting off the field on third downs. Great performance, a great team performance by Colorado today. Well, this coaching staff, they believe that this defense could be special this year and maybe the future in good hands as well. The backup, Steven Montez, showing some ability. Yeah, Steven Montez, the player who won most improved in the spring, did a great job of executing the offense. He showed his mobility, got outside the pocket, hooked up for a couple of touchdown passes, and did a great job of, of leading this offense. So, Sefo Lufau, we didn't even see him in the second half, throws for 204 yards, 54 rushing, three touchdowns, and that defense holding Idaho State to just 96 total yards. It was an impressive showing by the defense. Up front, they dominated. They were in the backfield all day. And in the secondary, it was like they were in, their, in the receivers' minds. They knew the routes they were running. They were knocking down passes, and they were getting off the field on third down. So Colorado, they passed the test. Don't look past the FCS opponent before you hit the road and go to Ann Arbor. They did not. They win 56-7. to